presented on the need to have insurers of LCC assess damages, renovate the plaza, and to resume its business in our considered view will not take the toll away, as it will always remain in that location and to which every member of the public have access. Just that was the order day, issued on Saturday, 6 February 2021, for the, for the repossession of the Lekki Toll Plaza by the Lekki Concession Company. It was a decision that split the panel, with the minority presenting a dissenting position, saying that there are still many unanswered questions on the matter. Days after that approval was given, the most visible feature at the Lekki toll gate is the free flow of traffic on both sides of the road, with motorists going through the gates without payment of toll. We made an attempt to speak to representative of LCC, which did not work out. But off records, a staff explained that reports were made available to the public by the organization in due time on the latest development. The ENSA's protest and shooting of unarmed demonstrators, which occurred in October 2020, has left many Nigerians, especially people who lost their loved ones, expecting justice from the judicial panel of inquiry. I think it is not helpful if we disrupt uh, one of the first or foremost examples of that provision of private infrastructure. Uh, but that does not take away from the fact that the wrong happened there severe, terrible wrong that our country should never forget. My view is that we should erect some kind of cenotaph, I don't know what I call it, cenotaph, memorial around it, but we shouldn't prevent the company from operating at all. Despite the controversy trailing the order for LCC to repossess a facility, Justice Many still hope that the final outcome of the proceedings will ensure justice is served on the matter to bring a closure to the whole saga.